task is going to be to remove the door handles um, so I can get those off for refinishing as you'll see the writing is gone off of here again a product of hitting it with a little bit of rubbing alcohol to remove the tackiness and the manufacturer on this one you know screwed me so it's going to refinishing a little quicker than I'd expected but anyways to get to that we need to take the uh, Take the handle off here, uh, simply you press up on the back side, pop the clip, slide it back this way. See, that's what catches on the front end. There's the clip on the back. And then uh, we're going to be loosening this nut right here so that we can get some slack in the cable to remove the, uh, the door handle. So, next thing we're going to do is uh, hit a, put a Sharpie mark on there for reference and uh, loosen that up. Okay, so what I did was um, I loosened up this nut all the way so that I was able to then slide this and get the cable out so that I'd have plenty of slack for the doorknob. Next thing we need to do is there's a leather cover down on the door handle, this piece here. See if it's like this. So you just get a, a tool up underneath there, pry it up, it's just held by by butyl rubber or monkey snot as they call it down there so we'll need to pull that screw so besides that screw that needs to be removed we'll also need to remove that screw underneath the door handle so once you get both screws out that one and that one it holds the door handle down this is what we're left with so we're going to have to pop these connectors off in order to remove the handle. So that's next. Okay, so this is the clip that holds on this micro switch that's on the inner side of the door right here. So all you do is you this sits on here. The clip sits with this detent towards the inside of the, of the switch. I just grab it with a pair of needle nose and gently pull downward and it comes off. And then once it's off, then the switch comes off. Then we don't remove this clamp for the other switch. Instead, there's a screw back here, right there, that we undo and the other switch will come off. And then we should be able to get the door handle free. All right, so the handle's out. This is where the second screw uh, for the micro switch was and then that hole right there is where the cable slides into okay so you just wiggle that out and, uh, and it comes free okay so we're on the passenger side same routine uh, slide up under here pop this up go ahead and mark the nuts we'll loosen those up the only difference on this side is going to be that we're going to have to take the door handle off. So there's an Allen there, and then two up there to pull the handle off. Uh, under here, if you see it, there's still a screw up under there. Uh, we'll need to undo, and then same thing, routine with the clips. So we'll get to that. Okay, so this is the passenger side with the switches removed. Uh, we just got this Z cable to wiggle off. It's got that beautiful rubber stuff around there, so just need to wiggle and jiggle that. Then the, uh, the next thing is to get this out. Supposedly there's a hidden screw somewhere. Alright, so once you uh, use a handy dandy little plastic tool, go around the edge here, pop this out, and you'll see where that hidden screw is right there. So once we get that out then this whole bracket assembly will come out all right so this is a little tricky to get out and uh, just because of the way this bracket is so the screws undone all the stuff is undone what you want to do is pull this out and then rotate 
and then it, the assembly comes out. And uh, getting it, putting it in is, is just the same way. So there you go. Door handles removed. Door levers removed. Everything is ready for shipping to be refinished.